All right, what's going on, everybody? I've got five brand new iOS tweaks for you guys today from Cydia. I will be doing full length uh, reviews of each one, so you can just click the links below for each one or whatever one that you're interested in. You can go ahead and click that link. So the first application I've got for you guys today is called iSwipe. What iSwipe is gonna allow you to do is change the way you type on your iPhone or iDevice. So basically, instead of just using the regular keys and touching to type, what you would do is just hold on to any key and drag your finger across. So let's make a sentence here, let's just keep it simple. Hello. Thanks. For watching. So as you can see, you just have to drag your finger to the uh, buttons that you want there. Again, I'm going to have a full length review right over here. So if you click that link right there, that's going to be a full length review of iSwipe. So that's basically your just a general overview of what iSwipe is going to do for you. Definitely give this one a uh, download or check it out in the Cydia store. Alright, so the next week I've got for you guys today is called Playing Lyrics. And what this is going to be able to do for you is when you open a song here, I'm just going to open black and yellow. I'm not going to play it because of copyright issues. But basically, if you add lyrics via iTunes, and I will show you how to do all of this, it will be in the um, video if you just click that link right over there. All of the instructions on how to get lyrics and how to actually add this application uh, and a full length review will be in that link but anyways um, when you have lyrics here on the screen basically what this application will allow you to do is you can just hold the status bar here and a little pop-up shows up there saying uh, do you want to show the lyrics of your playing song so if you click yes there then you just get a pop-up of the lyrics. So let's say that your iPod application isn't actually open, but you're just listening to music in the background. Let me open up the iPod. So let's say that music was playing. I'm not going to play it again for copyright issues. Then all you would have to do, let's say if you wanted to just, um, if you forgot the lyrics or you just kind of wanted to know the lyrics at that particular point of the song, you can just hold the status bar here, enable playing lyrics, and the lyrics will pop up right on your springboard there. Now, this application is from the Big Boss repo. You can download it for free. And again, I will have a full length review, so go ahead, oops, go ahead and check that out in the link below. All right, guys, the next week I've got for you is called Camera Lock Plus. Basically, with this application, what you'll be able to do is just tap this icon that's beside your lock, your slide lock at the bottom there, and put in your password if you have one enabled and that will just launch the application as soon as it's open. By default, it's set to the camera application. So the actual application icon there will not change. It doesn't matter if you have it set to camera or to anything else, it is going to stay the same, but it will launch whatever application you set it to. Um, so again, I'll just put a link right around here uh, where you can click and that'll give you a full length review of that application and I can show you some of the options as well. Okay, so the fourth application I've got for you guys today, instead of going with page names, it was kind of giving me a little bit of trouble, so I'm going to be showing you Message 2. It's a really simple application. All you have to do is go into wiggle mode by holding any icon on your springboard, and if you double tap the mail icon or the uh, messages icon, that will just simply open a brand new message so you can just send off an email to whatever, whoever you want there, and same thing goes for the messages application. So really nice, really simple, and easy to use. Um, so if you you know have uh, lots of contacts or whatever, and you don't feel like opening the application to scroll through them, you can just go into your wiggle mode, double tap, and it just shoots off straight, <laughs> and it just goes straight into your messages application for email or SMS. All right, and the last week I've got for you guys today is called SB fader sb fader and what this is going to allow you to do you can actually set the settings in the settings application but i'll go through that in the link shown on the screen right there and uh, go through the whole review so basically with sb fader it just gives you a nice fade animation between pages um, from the springboard to an application or from the application back to the springboard if i open the settings tab and go back to the springboard it goes nice and slow and you can see um, the way that everything faded there from page to page everything fades in and you can actually set 
the um, the fade lengths, the transparency, all that kind of good stuff you can set in the settings. I'll just give you a quick peek, but make sure to click that link if you're interested in this application for a lot more information and a little review. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure if you like these tweaks to hit that subscribe button above. I'll have lots more city tweaks coming. Um, I will definitely be getting them to you as quickly as possible. I know that it's been a while since my last video, but go ahead and click that subscribe button and you'll get all the new city of tweaks and applications that I choose to review. If you have any that you want to see, make sure to post it in the comments below. Um, tell me about what you thought about these tweaks in the comments below as well. If you like them, if you don't like them, if they worked out for you or not. And make sure to hit that like button in the corner. And I guess I'll see you next time, guys. So make sure again to subscribe. And I'll see you later, guys. Peace. It feels great just to hold it. Just to look at it while I'm shooting myself. I mean, shooting myself. Just just while I'm, like, actually filming. It looks... It's nice to look at. I mean, my old...